Don't you just love spring? One of my favorite things about spring is that opportunity to get out in the yard, dig in the soil, because Middletown High School students have told me it is not dirt, work on my rose bushes and my beautiful pots of annuals, just watching all the buds begin to burst, doing some pruning, getting things ready, and then waiting, waiting for that incredible burst of color. If you are a gardener like me, in the next couple of weeks, you really need to take advantage of the opportunity to get out to our high school plant sales. I spent a couple of hours on Saturday just going through the many, many plants that were available at Linganore High School. And I got quite a collection, and they are now at my house ready, waiting. It was still a little cold over the weekend, so we kept them in the garage. but. I have many plants that I put together, planters that I sit out on my patio and in the front of my house. And the students at Linganore were very gracious. They were helping me look at some new ideas for those planters and are wonderful in carrying your many containers to your car. Beautiful potted plants that I love to hang. But one of my favorites, and our students don't grow these, are rose bushes. Right now, I have approximately 14 rose bushes in my backyard, and I'm planning to add some more along the back of the fence. I love to do different varieties, different colors. I love their names. I have Blue Girl, Peace, Pink Promise, the John F. Kennedy Tea Rose, Ginger Snap. And at one point, I had Coco in one of my other houses, but I just love the opportunity to watch them bloom. They bloom forever. They bloom into the fall. So a great burst of color in your room. But this year, moving into a new house and a new development, my roses and I had quite a struggle. From black spot to beetles to that incredibly cold winter, unfortunately, I lost about five of my rose bushes. But no worries. The nurseries all have a half price return guarantee. So I dug up the dead bushes, took them into the nursery, replaced those five and got a few more to add. So if you love gardening, you know, like me, that it is that time of year where you start to get the itch and it is so great to get out there and see things come alive, much like our students do this time of year as well.